Hello and welcome to another Cricut Design Space tutorial by Go Needle. Today I'm going to be showing you how to use these five options in the layer panel. Slice, Wield, Attach, Flatten, and Contour. So to start, let's choose a, ch let's choose a shape. Start with a square. And let's just make it a different color to make it easier to see. And we'll choose another shape as well. Let's go with a triangle. Here we go. Just keep this another color as well. There. So, let's start with the first option, Slice. So Slice is a really simple tool. What it will do is, say you want this square, but you want a triangle inside of it as a space. All you have to do is take this triangle you have here, put it on top of this, and then you simply have to select both the triangle and the square, and you can select Slice. What this does is it slices, it creates a single hole inside this square that you made. There's a triangle inside, as you can see, and it also creates the other triangle you have outside. Now, say you want to attach these two triangles together, make it look something like this, like two, like two mountains in a mountain range. All you have to do that is shift, click both of them, and you can go ahead and click Wield. What this does, it, it combines both the triangles into one singular image. You can do this for absolutely anything. Now to the next option, which is Attach. Now for this tool, say you want this image right here, this right here, and let's grab another triangle right here and put it down here. Say you want Cricut to print this out exactly like it is. So, so alright, let's go to make it. These weren't in the same order that they are, or arrangement, as they are here. See, so you want it to come in the exact same arrangement as it is here. All you have to do is select all the images, click attach, and what that does is once you go to make it, as you can see, it'll print exactly how you have laid it out in the Cricut design space. And now, to choose to show you about flatten and contour, we will go to images, select an image with multiple layers such as this one right here. Go ahead and insert that image, make it a little bigger so it's easier to see. Now say you want to make this into a print and cut file, so it'll come all into one singular print. Um, all you have to do is select this image right here, go ahead to the bottom and click Flatten. What this does is makes it so that it is one layer by itself. So when you go to make it, as you can see this is the registration box and it will come as one singular print. Now let's undo that and bring it back to normal. And for contour, this is what it can do. Say you have the blue colored parts and you want to get rid of a certain part. Say you don't want these little pieces at the end and you want to get rid of just those. All you have to do for that is simply first click the image and go ahead and ungroup it. Then click on the blue parts and go ahead and tap contour. Now you can see all the parts that are that blue color in the image. So all you have to do is tap on the parts you don't want, or the ones you want to hide. So those two little pieces on the side. You can go ahead and exit that. And now, as you can see, those two parts have disappeared. And that's how you use the contour. Thank you for watching, and please subscribe to our channel if you would like more information on Cricut Design Space or other how-to videos. Thank you.